Okay, so I've been doing uh, some research. This name that came to me, Ka'an or Khan, which means it means king. On my father's side, we have Mongolian blood because we're Hungarian. Um, it used to be one region, uh, you know, before it got divided, it was Austria Hungary. Uh, Austria Hungary. And um, we have Shoshone blood, my uh, dad's mother. Um, and they're okay, so that's where near he where he was born in Wyoming. And there are the Shoshone. The Shoshone are a federally recognized tribe. There's only two, the Arapaho and the Shoshone. There's only two in Wyoming that are federally recognized. And there's there's no state recognition of any tribes in Wyoming, but there's two federally recognized tribes in Wyoming, the Arapaho and then our tribe Shoshone. Um, from my father's bloodline, okay, and this explains one of the, you know, biggest reasons why I'm a targeted individual, so I've been doing all this research on Tengrism, T-E-N-G-R-I-S-M, which was the religion of the um, ancient Mongols, and they were very in tune and in touch with shamanism, and connected to the ancestors, and Tengri was the name of um, basically the sky god. The uh, it's also called Mo Mongolia is called the land of the eternal blue sky, and Tengri is the sky god, and Tengrism, like I said, has to do with shamanism, being in tune with the ancestors, the ancients. Okay, that and that's what I'm all about. And I get these messages of things in my dream that, in my dreams that I've never even heard about. Like when I was told by God that I've alerted the AKE, I had to go research that shit. Um, when I was told beware the dark actors the night um, after Robin Williams died, uh, that night I had a dream where I was warned by God beware the dark actors. And you can look that book up. Okay, this was a guy who was targeted. And um, so this ancient blood bloodline on my father's side, I believe the Aleut are probably, um, because they're like the Alaskan Native Americans are descendants of the ancient Mongols, I believe. And I also believe the Shoshone and the Aleut are connected. So there's, you know, ancient Mongolian tribes that are considered Native American, but they're actually ancient uh, Mongolian bloodlines. And the Khazars is where we originated from. Okay, the Shoshone, the Aleut, all, all the uh, Mongolian type um, Native American tribes. Um, if not, if not all of them, but I believe certain ones have the ancient Mongolian bloodline, and it's from my father's side because he's Hungarian. Um, both of his grandparents were Mongoli uh, were <laughs> Hungarian. They're from Austria, but it used to be one empire. Okay, and my grandmother, black hair, dark skin, looks very much Mongolian and Native American blood. Okay, she's where we get the Shoshone. So the Khazars. This is the bloodline that I'm from, and this is, you know, why certain individuals are targeted because of these ancient bloodlines that they're connected to, okay? And it's no coincidence that certain tribes are federally recognized, because if you're federally recognized, then it probably has something to do with how much access they have to your information and all that stuff, so... Or perhaps not, but I just thought it was interesting that Wyoming 
um, isn't there's no state recognition of any tribes for Wyoming and only two federally recognized tribes, one being the Shoshone and Atapaho, the other one. So, um, yeah, the Khazars. So, just wanted to share that. I'm still doing more research on that, but Tengrism, that's my religion. <laughs> so, love and blessings to you all and peace be upon you all.